guys, we are back at it with episode 16 of Wakun Demon School Aramaka. Now, in last week's episode, a lot of you guys did mention that it did feel a bit more of a filler and like nothing honestly happened. And I do quite agree with you guys there. I really expected last week's episode to kind of explain to us why Kiro Senpai was planning on kind of like making this explosion at the school. Why also one of the head 13 demons was after like Fabulous the school as well as kind of like Oji Chan's maybe reputation as well. So I'm really hoping that this episode will give us a bit more answers than last week's episode did like don't get me wrong it was still a very enjoyable episode but it definitely did kind of go in the category of filler so i guess let us just jump into this episode and see what it has in store for us if you guys want to watch along i'll be starting the video in three two one let's go oh what grand music Oh yeah, I did like how we do have like an additional goal of kind of aiming for the grand prize because then Kiro Senpai would go up two ranks and everyone else would go up a rank as well. Of course they'll help you, Irma. <gasps> oh, Azzy, you're just so wholesome towards Irma. God. Oh, honestly, Arama's happiness is my happiness. <laughs> Senpai, please reconsider. Oh, Kiri Senpai worries me. I think like Arama will talk him out of it. Hopefully like Arama can does find out his kind of plans before it happens and he is able to use talk no jutsu and power of friendship jutsu. Um, I would like it if they didn't go down kind of a, a typical route. I feel like because it's just like I've enjoyed Welcome to Demon School, Amakun, because it's like, it's got a kind of simple setting, but it's always done concepts well. So I think I would, it would be quite neat if they didn't go down such like a, a kind of like typical route. Like, don't get me wrong. There's nothing about being like cliche or anything. Like I think Amakun is the definition of just like a cliche kind of concept, but like the funky aspects, the characters, like comedy, all of that has just been done so top tier that it makes like, a cliche idea equally as good as any like unique or you know um like individual kind of anime so like it's nothing bad if it goes down that road but i just would like to something a bit more than that ideally like that's kind of what i hope of the anime um i don't see like i can't predict anything differently they could do because like kiro senpai i think he just does need a bit of like convincing and seeing like a different kind of viewport. Oh my god, how did I not realize that in the opening? You know how Clara's summoning is that like green um thing? I just realized that in the opening while Clara's like defending the monster, the um familiar is just like scratching his neck. I just realized that because I guess we only got introduced to Clara's familiar a couple of episodes back. But I just realized that detail in the opening. <laughs> I wonder when we start the new arc, we'll get a different opening and ending. Considering this is a 24 episode anime, I believe, and we still haven't got any change. Ooh, <gasps> cotton candy! Why did the apple and cotton candy look normal? <laughs> Maybe it's not. Maybe it'll be like spiderweb cotton candy, which I'll take a hard pass on. Yeah! Wow! <laughs> Where is Clara? Where is Clara? Pink, Kama, Kama, what? Oh, he likes it. Converse my energy, don't lie to me, senpai. 
Yakisoba. Everything looked good until. I want yakisoba. Oh, <gasps> Irma, oh my God. Excuse me. Oh my god, he's already done, isn't he? Oh, Erma, you show him who is a boss. <gasps> he ate, oh my god, Erma's true plan is to go around and eat everyone out of business and get rid of the competition. I wonder what Softness Club's doing. Because he's in the book club. <laughs> I love how Sobanok and Adzi have more of a rivalry going on. <laughs> He's going to act out as playing the Demon King. That's so sub not for you. Ricky Clara just throwing that confetti. Oh. Oh my god, I want that hoodie. It's a misfit class. <laughs> that looks pretty nice. Oh, it's like a tempura. What a useful skill to have. If, like, being a high-ranked demon fails for you, you can always become a sashimi chef. I eat, therefore I am. Beautiful! That was a masterpiece of a speech. <laughs> Ooh, he's in a pretty exciting club. Water from rock. Ooh. Oh my god, they made VR sorcery hats. <laughs> oh, eh? Huh? That's a term and condition that we did not need. <laughs> no hentai games made yet. <laughs> Is that your secret goals or like dreams? That's beautiful. Ooh, that's epic. There's so many cool battlers. <laughs> As he summoned, I freaking love As he summoned. Nervous laughter covering. <laughs> mm. 
my rifle. Strike fast for certain victory. And this kind of gives me like Harry Potter, like Hogwarts themes to the music. Wow! Wow! <laughs> I hope nothing fails. Beautiful, Azzy. 10 out of 10 plan. Kaj was like, we're gonna party! <laughs> I just hope they know it's from like their club. That's all I'm worried about. I'm sorry, Clara. I love you, but I feel like you would destroy the thing before it even happened. Clara? Clara? No, 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 no. Oh my god, Azzy's fire won't go out because it's super strong, isn't it? Oh, it failed? I guess that was a good experiment to make sure it works. <sighs> yes. Yes, you did. <laughs> Oh, Clara, I love you, but... <laughs> At least you apologize. Oh, I was just about to say, I feel like the senpai took the shell and maybe put something else in there for it to be fired off. I still can't get used to him throwing off his glasses. Has somebody always had one horn or is that just like the angle? Oh, he has a smaller horn on the other side. Why do they keep using this scene of weird be exactly alike? It just hits me more in the feels. <laughs> I love how they're just playing chess. <laughs> He's just like, like useless subordinates. Oh, they do know about the human. What does he want? Who's your little birdie? Ooh. They look more like thugs. <laughs> Do you guys really think you could stop him?
Oh, that little foreshadow. We know what's gonna happen. Ah, uh, I'm there. Just here to appreciate the fireworks. Oh no, here to appreciate Irma as well. I love how we still refer to it as the forbidden text. I believe we have patrolled this area quite a lot. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I swear the best way to get through life is to be able to make bullshit up on the spot. Amir, what are you doing? Oh, it's just so cute that she wants to see fireworks. I want to interact with magical bees. Oh, they have eyeball boba. Oh my god, it's in like the light bulbs as well, which was super trending. Emma just went past you, honey. He's in the hidden room. Takoyaki! Oh, she lost her takoyaki. I was looking for him while fooling around. No, he just has other things in mind. Oh. Or oh, am I hope your trust in him and just like your respect for him stays. Oh, I'm so oh, just sad for Arama. Like you can just see the amount of like respect he has for Kira Senpai, and I feel like that's going to be very like disappointing for him when he finds out. Oh, background story? Ambition, hell of a grudge. But completely rotten on the inside. Of how demons should truly be, is that maybe what he was? Are those maybe like seals that are keeping his powers contained? Damn it, I thought he was going to be sad, but he's like, no, it's just the beginning. I thought he was going to be sad that it's all going to end with like his friendship with Irma and stuff, but I guess, I guess that doesn't matter right now. I love how she's got rainbow lipstick on in that corner over there. <laughs> Beautiful. I love what they did of just like, that has so many real life references.
<laughs> it is a daily. It is a daily. <laughs> I love Robin. He's just so hyper. Oh, this music is like kind of like a timer going off. It's just like tick tock, tick tock, and it's just like all leading up to it. Oh shit, it's happening! Oh. oh no! Oh, summer dog! <laughs> These girls are like, focus priorities! <laughs> Ooh, that seal put like a barricade around the school. Maybe it's so no one can get out or in. <laughs> I feel like the people in the VR are like, oh, what a great effect. Like, that ominous ass music that just kicked in. This is not all right. Ooh, Mr. Mom, where you at? So it's sectioned off everything. Oh my god, they're like everywhere. Why has everyone been specifically sectioned off? The party's about to begin and this is where it ends. Oh! Okay, look, look, I am a bit annoyed that the first half, like, okay, nearly three-fourths of it was once again just, like, the festival, just, like, the fireworks, Carrie Senpai rubbing his ears, rubbing his necklace all over again. I thought we'd officially get his background story, but we were just, like, kind of teased with that again, with it just being, like, oh, like, it's, like, show you ambitions, like, you're truly dark. And, like, we don't really get any answers out of that, so I'm a little disappointed. I am glad, though, that shit finally went down. Well, I'm not, like, glad that shit went down, but I'm glad that it's finally kind of happened. So it looks like definitely next week's episode will kind of sum up this arc. I'm not gonna lie, for normally how fast tempo... Amakun's always been maybe this is like the first major arc and everything else hasn't been like much of a story arc but like this one's quite long because like literally about three episodes oh okay like i'll be nice to say two was just like last week was definitely a filler this week also felt very fillerish like i do enjoy it like don't get me wrong i do enjoy fillers except for when you get into bleach fillers like that shit needs to be skipped sometimes i'm sorry <laughs> I knew they were going to do, like, Titanic shit on me. <laughs> so clearly, Rachel. I'm so close. Yet I cannot be any use of him. Oh, Clara. Everyone's just fine, isn't he? <laughs> Will Clara ever get her takiyakis? Find out next week. So yeah, I was just about to say, um, I guess I'm also sad that since it is a shorter series, I wish they would have had fillers. I mean, it's only been like one and a half, so it's not like I'm mad about it or anything, but it's just like, they have been dragging this out for a while. Like, Kira Senpai has been teasing us with that air rubbing 
for about at least a good two, three episodes now. And like Erema Kun has always been like bam, bam, bam and so quick about it. So I'm surprised that this arc has been a bit more dragged out than I thought it kind of would be. And I also think like it being dragged out is not going to help it either because when you drag something out, you expect more of like a hype, you know, it's been building it up. So I feel like next week's episode better be like an absolute banger or else I think I will be a bit more disappointed considering it's been dragged out for like at least a good solid two three episodes now do let me know what you guys think that are you guys kind of all good with the fillers like don't get me wrong it's not like i was mad about the fillers but i guess i just wanted them to kind of give us a bit more hint towards the actual storyline of the plot because it can be a filler but i do want a bit more information so i myself as the audience can also be kind of a part of the story but like it's being just more like food you know am i eating or like am i just like clara and abby's dynamic and i do enjoy seeing that but i do want to be a part of the plot they are following especially if they're going to constantly tease it with Kara senpai so yeah definitely do let me know what your guys kind of thoughts are on the last couple of episodes and this kind of like story arc that we are exploring as i do love hearing you guys opinion but yeah i guess until then i'm definitely excited for episode 17 in hopes that it will finally be the big kind of plot twist and reveal that we have been waiting for so until then make sure you guys stay awesome and i'll catch you guys in episode 17.